Welcome back to another day of Yu-Gi-Oh! We're what, 27%? 23%? And it's starting with a story, making the cut. Which it looks like Sora loses, as we can clearly see. So, you know, that's a thing. Kind of sucks for him. But hey! We get to play with a different character that isn't... Um... Yuya? Yeah! Alright, so, let's get this story rolling today. <sighs> Days earlier, when Jay met Declan... Say you're willing to duel me, but only if I enter the championship. Correct. That event will single out those duelists who are the best of the best to join my fight against Leo Akaba. Your father? You're battling your father. It is true that he is my father. He's also our common enemy, and I will stop at nothing to take him down. Among the other duelists who are competing, there is one who used uses the most powerful fusions I've ever detected. Sora Purse. Back to the present for the Junior Arc League Championship. Wow, so fusions are a big part of this series, it seems. It's time for today's third mega matchup. It's You Show School Sora Purse versus Leo Institute's Shea Obsidian. I can't believe Shay's dueling for the Leo Institute after all the drama he had with Julia. Shay was the one who attacked Julia's professor and all those LID students. You're right. Something weird's definitely going on here. <laughs> the match is about to begin. So watch as our action field spins, spins, spins! Looks like we'll be battling in Neo Heartland City! What? What's the matter, Shay? You feeling sick or something? Don't worry about me. Just worry about yourself. Fusion summoners like you deserve no mercy. Wow. That will be shown. Okay, let's start the show. Okay. So I'm Shay. That's, um... So interesting. Oh, wow. Oh, God. That's already not good. All right, let's see what we got. Graveyard. Oh, wow, the rank up. Once per turn, all right. That's the one I'm going to want. I think. Okay, good. Hmm. We'll do that. And then... No. So it's this one. Yes. Uh, 
Oh. Would have been great. Not for that. Special summon one monster with the same name as a hand or deck. Do I want to, though? If I summon another four, that's three. So I should probably try to wait a turn. This card can attack all special summon monsters your opponent controls once each. Okay. If a raptor XYZ monster... Well, let's not worry about it yet, right? Wait a turn. And even then, I don't think I want to. Ooch. Well, that's a sad start for me, isn't it? I think we're boned. That is kind of frightful for... <sighs> if you take damage, you can special it from your hand now, so you cannot special Okay. Well, that's fine. Well, that's a... Plus. This might be what I have to do. Target one, Rapid Raider, XYZ, Monster, New Graveyard. I was one rank higher than the monster... Okay. From my hand to destroy the attacking. Shall we? Okay. And if you control a monster, you can special summon it. If this card is, you can add one from your deck to your hand. Once per turn, you can special monsters the turn you activate either of this card effects. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Oh, no, that was the one I didn't want to... All right. Oh well, I think we do kind of have it. I did kind of screw up. I wanted to keep it just in case he brought something out. But... If you take damage, you can switch. No. No. Yes. Yes. Thank you. 
Okay. And then, since I do want him to... It's not quite what I want. I want that other card to kind of... Oh. When a spell trap card is very well, you control or negate the activation. Okay. I mean, I guess I didn't see that coming, but. He kind of played his hand early like I do sometimes, but I think for the most part this went to my advantage. I didn't know that that was going to happen, but unless he comes up with a miracle, I'm going to win. Oh. Maybe. What does this do? And what did he bring back? Nah. We're gonna raptor him. We're gonna Rex Raptor him! Kinda figured that was his only play. If this card attacked, you can turn one on your graver. Cool. Oh, well, yeah, but no. Nice! I win! And I thought I was so screwed because of that summon, but... Nope. Go. Revolution Falcon! Burn Blaze! Torch the enemy. Ah! Stop it. This isn't how you should duel. Dueling is supposed to make people happy, not scare them. We have a winner! This duel goes to Shay! Can't lose. Not to an XYZ summoner. It's impossible. Shay, I want to rematch. You have to duel me. Don't go. A dark little flex shot. Alright, now I gotta play the reverse deck, and that one scares me, actually. Edge Imp Saw. Oh, boy. Alrighty. Parallel Port Armor. Oh, goodness gracious. Well, that didn't turn out too bad. <laughs> Wonderful. Edge Imp Chain plus one Fluffle Monster, which is all these are. If this card battles your opponent's card. Uh... Oh, wow. So 2800, that's not bad. Mm. Frightful Chimera. Three. Fright for monsters. Oh, that's Fluffle. So, I guess... Right, there's the third one. Monster to this card is an equip... The equip monster gains a thousand attack. Dang. Uh, must be... Uh, 
battles your opponent cannot activate cards effects. Dang, that is frightful indeed. If this card is sent to the graveyard as a fusion. Add it to my hand. Until the end of the battle phase. So. Target one flow monster in your graveyard. Special summon. That's my best bet to save myself 1500. Yeah, I don't know what that's going to accomplish, but it's going to scare me. Page of destroyed. Hmm. Well, that's not good. Uh, well. That's a plus until he turns something into defense mode, then that's going to suck. Maybe. No. Well, now I'm not fully happy and I've got to use my bear. Sure. Uh All right. Well, I don't have a choice. I've got to use the fluffle. First this. Cuz I can't let him XYZ. This is going to hurt though. No. Oh. Unless he chooses not to. Uh, you can special summon this card from your hand. You can return one other fluffle monster you control to the hand. Yes, unless he has... Okay, that's new. <sighs> this is just not great. Boy. 
way. This is going really weird, in all honesty. No. Yeah, can we please? You can add one edge, Imp. Oh, I wish I knew which was which, but it's too late now, right? No, wait, no, it's not. When this card's normal summon, you can summon. What are their effects? When this card okay. From the hand or field to the graveyard, you can summon. In your graveyard, you can place one card from your hand on top of the deck. Let's do it. bear I want the bear but that's the one thing I don't have do I, I have the sheep and the rabbit sheep gives 800 the rabbit must be neither crap okay so let's bring the sheep back shall we yes Thank you. <sighs> oh boy. card is in your hand, you can target one, right? Okay. Let it go. <sighs> Thankfully, he needs three level fours at the least, and I'm not even letting him have that. summon this turn for obvious reasons. Yeah, of course. <sighs> the 
This match is very intense on my end. Even though I know he can't X, Y, Z. Wow. Okay, you can sell this card from your hand to the graveyard. <gasps> no, what's this one? This card declares an uh, field to the graveyard. You can add one frightful card from your deck to your hand. All right. Oh, okay. That's not quite what I wanted, but you know what? At this point, whatever. I, I thought I could do the bear, but apparently not. So I assume this is just over? Okay. Fusion summon one frightful fusion monster from your deck. Event. From your field or graveyard. One Palmer's in our fusion spell card from your graveyard, except different wave motion. Fightful from your extra use monsters from your hand, or if this card is sent to the graveyard, you can turn. Yeah, I like the frightful fusion. Let's try it. Ah. I think I've almost won. Unless he draws Dark Hole, which would be just god awful. Two, four, six. No, I've won as long as this goes through. And he has nothing to, you know. Oh no, he can't, Kenny. Wow. Nice. Shay Obsidian. Rank up magic, skip force. Please, Falcon. Okay. Neat. So a dark reflection. During a break in the tournament, Zuzu shared everything she knew about Yuto and Shay. So, let Gong get this straight. Shay's sister is one of the friends they're trying to save, and someone who Fusion summons took her. That's what Yuto told me. Then that means they must think Sora knows where she is. Well, searching for Shay, Sora ran into Yuto instead. Bring me Shay. We're the ones who hunt down you XYZ summoners, not the other way around. Not happening. I'm going to rescue Lulu, and it starts right here. Let's duel. Sora, Zuzu told me about Shay's sister. I think they think you know where Lulu is. She said that she heard it from Yuto. You're Yuto, right? Is it all true? It is. Okay then, so why do you think Sora is mixed up in all this? If he won't talk, I will. When my people gain control of the XYZ dimension. Whoa! What, Sora? They all fled like rats on a sinking ship. XYZ dimension? We left so we could fight another day against those from your fusion dimension. You really attacked them? That's right, back at Duel Academy. Duel Academy? Oh god. I was chosen for a special mission, a mission I won't fail. But before Sora could attack, his Duel Disc self-activated, teleporting him away. Huh? No! You can't take me away now! Uh, Sora, Yuto... Where is he? What did you do to Sora? Sora went back to the fusion dimension. His home. No offense, but that's a crazy story. Like something from a sci-fi movie. 
I wish that it were, but I was there. I saw it happen. Our homeland was attacked by the fusion warriors. As for my people, they captured them by trapping their souls into cards. Are there other dimensions? Yes. There's a synchro dimension, too, and it has its own warriors. And your world has come to be known simply as the standard dimension. Ouch. Straight to the heart, and that just hurt. Let me get this straight. There are four dimensions. Fusion, XYZ, Synchro, and Standard. And they're all fighting each other. But why? Why would the dimensions all want to do this? One man. Leo Akaba. Is that Leo? Yuya had many more questions. But the conversation was interrupted by the sudden appearance of a duelist on a duel runner. Now we're getting into 5D as well. Wow, this is like linking everything together. Maybe Arc 5. It's you. You go. You're who I've been searching for. Uh, getting a big migraine here. Would somebody mind telling me why there's now another guy who looks just like me? Because there's five U's. Your loser buddies aren't here to save you this time. I demand a rematch. Hear it now. <laughs> That's a laugh. I don't need anybody to save me from a fusion follower like you. No go. I warned you before. Don't call me no go. The name's you go. So there's like multiple. So two you yes are, are, are dueling. Oh, this is. This is something else. Okay, what type of duelist am I? I'm lost. Okay, I'm a synchro. Okay. Iron Call. If you control a machine monster, target one level for a lower monster. Machine monster in your graveyard, uh, but its effects are negated. Also, it's destroyed at the end of the turn. All right, awesome. Sure. Yes. Attack the turns at normal once per turn. You can turn one piece of monster on the field. Dang. Okay, you know what? That's fine. That makes six. With this card, uh... okay. Let's see what we got. Wait, what effect? 
Oh. Okay, cool. Okay, well, it wasn't that. Once return, you can detach one, uh, then turn one card you control and one card in your opponent's control, destroy them. Wow, you son of a bitch. Alright. I don't have a choice. That's bullshit right there. Wow, what the fuck is this? Fuck you, dude. Just fuck you. All that in one turn? You really do need to go fucking blow yourself. Nice, it's a tuner. <sighs> so if I do that... I guess I don't have a choice. I don't want to lose it. Aren't I? Come forth, Dark Rebellion XYZ Dragon. Yeah, and he did. Uh, he pulled like eight moves all in one turn. That kind of really pissed me off. All right, let's activate Mystical Space on one card. We'll do that one. Not yet. Let's do it! Guess it sucks, but... Oh, wow. He might have that Phantom Knight card that stops effect monsters from using... Their effects of attacking. Also, most of his traps have graveyard effects. All right, that's good to know. Okay, when an opponent's on uh, those cards, you know, some of those card in attack position, your opponent controls. Okay, so I want to keep that one. Cannot attack the turns its normal summon. One face-up monster on the field. Change this card to defense position. If you do that, target loses in. And... Okay. Well, let's go ahead and bring him back. All right, we'll see what happens then. Oh, I can't summon anything else. Okay, well. I mean, he can't do anything unless he's got a revival card, right? So, 
Uh, fuck. Oh wait, that just let him drew. I still might be all right. Oh my god. Even it, even the cards in the graveyard is allowing him to do crap. This is Phantom Knights. They live in the graveyard. Ugh. Yeah, I, I think this deck pisses me off. I don't have a choice. I gotta try to re-wipe him out. So, I have a dilemma. I can't kill anything. So that did not go the way I wanted. Ah, fuck. Well, I'm gonna lose. Miserably. Because he can't attack. So, I guess I don't have a choice. I mean, if you don't attack, you're screwed. Well, I can't attack anyway. I got nothing that can attack. That thing's 100, and this thing can't attack the first turn that it's uh, summoned. So, I, I literally can't attack. The best I could have done was resummon him. But. It is normal summon. So it can attack, but it's not gonna do any good now. Uh. Okay. But I got nothing that can... Wow, this is just a fucking joke. Ugh. Because I can't even weaken that son of a bitch. <sighs> yeah, no, I'm I'm boned either way. <sighs> All right, so how do I how do I want to how, how do I want to blues? effects are negated. So I can't even... Alright! When you really think about it, you know as you go directs counter because XYZ monsters don't have levels, so clear wings effects is useless. How did he win this fight? I don't know, honestly. I know I got boned all because he played two cards, summoned this, killed my synchro, and then summoned that son of a bitch all in one turn. Right, but I can't turn it to defense mode. <sighs> I'm screwed either way, right? So, unless there's something amazing in my hand, ah, fucking course. The card you were talking about where he could negate shit. Yeah. 
Why the computer so sweaty? Allure of darkness? Yeah, that was its first play. It alert of darkness. It sent something to the graveyard. It brought two or three things out. Summoned this. Killed itself and that. Then did something to bring another two monsters out. Oh yeah, it was this effect. And then summon that son of a bitch. <laughs> I there's the trap I was talking about. Yep. I mean, it wasn't going to save me, but he is being completely sweaty. Like, I just wanted... I just wanted to kill things. Oh, I wanted to kill the thousand monster. All right, well, I'm not dead yet. I said, all right, it can't attack. I really think I hate these cards. I feel like it's a deck Bakura would use in current day, Yu-Gi-Oh. I couldn't even surrender next turn. He completely just wrecked me. Special summon Speedroid Terratop and search for Speedroid Red Eyes dies. Okay, I'll have to remember that. All right, let's try this again. Yeah, no, I don't even know how, being the complete opposite. Oh, that match boned me from the very beginning. I had the advantage for one turn. Also, it's a big, uh, you fest. Uh, okay, two mystical spaces. Yippee. You've got to be fucking kidding me. I'm not taking any chances. First, let's see what this does. Cannot be tributed. During your standby phase is in the graveyard. Okay, you can special summon this card. Oh my god. Alright, screw it. Let's destroy whatever he has. Because I need every advantage, and I don't trust any of his mother loving cards at this point. Would have been horrible if I had a mystical space the same card twice. Uh, okay, there's the King Fog. So that's a plus. Oh, yeah! He summoned that the first turn. This AI is the sweatiest. I have seen Allure and Reinforcements. Two Allures, even. Not even just one. Two Allures, a Reinforcement, something to destroy my monsters, and something to bring something out. Uh, okay. Okay, and it said to bring out the eyes. Did I just normal summon or did I special summon it? Please let me have special summoned it. Great, two traps with graveyard effects. Red eyes dies. When this card is normal summoned, you can turn one speedroid monster you control from one to six. Okay. So three. So I have all the choices in the world right now. All right. So what's my best choice here? At the start of the damage stuff, if the card battles a special summon monster, you can make this card's attack become double its current attack. Battles a special summon monster. Once per turn during the end phase of this card's in the graveyard because of that. Okay. We know what he does. This card can make a second attack during each... Okay. So... 
than the one it probably wants me to summon. When another level 5 or higher monster activates its effect on the field, you can, and if you do, destroy it. Why the heck not? So that means I want four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I want four. Yes. Okay, no, 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 I gotta do that. And do six, okay. <sighs> and remember, I have no idea what I'm doing with this deck, because I've only played it twice now, and I didn't get time to even learn anything about it. Oh yes, I always forget about that second effect. That's good, means he can pop you with the rank three. He can't pop you with the rank three monster. Okay, that's good. Okay, so. Negate the activation, right. Once per turn, when a monster, that target went to level five or higher monster on the field and no other cards quick. Okay. And what does speed? Target one speedroid monster in your graveyard. Special summon it during your main phase, except this turn. You can banish this card from your graveyard, then target one speedroid monster in your graveyard and add it to your hand. We'll save that just in case he comes back. Okay. Well, let's see what this thing can do and if it can last. Yeah, go figure there. But at the same time, if the negation destroys him and the effect ring three effects still goes on, he can't go into Dark Rebellion, so that's also kind of bad. <laughs> Fucking kidding me. Okay. <laughs> Oh boy, he's got 3,000, huh? Okay, so... Uh, again, we want to bring out the red eyes. Dice thing, if possible. I don't know if I can though, so I might have to speed recovery, but we'll we'll wait and see here. Okay. You can make this That's not gonna save me. That's not gonna save me. So basically I'm already boned again. No, that's not true. That's not true. I just gotta play this. Okay, no, no, no. I got the idea. I got the idea. So, we special summon him again. Yes. We see if there's any red eyes. Mother! If only you had Crystal Wing at this point. I had an idea. I was going to summon him, turn him into defense mode, lose the 800. <sighs> okay, no, wait. This still isn't over. Okay, maybe. Okay. Speedroid monster, but that's not... It is. Okay. It is, but I've got to think now. Does this summon it to the field? 
Okay, it does. Awesome. That saves my... Let's activate it. Let's bring the Roid back out. Just to be safe. Yes. Well, six it again. We'll resummon him, which will destroy that up there. And he's out of... Oh, right. His deck is a graveyard, isn't it? But normally he'd be out of cards. Okay. Okay. That's kind of cool. And then... You can target one face-up monster on the field. Change this card to defense position. Yes. His graveyard is his deck. Yeah, I remember you telling me that. Right, that's what he did last time. And now I'm reboned. <sighs> Fuck, I hate this deck. Even when you wipe him out, he still got it. Yep, and now he resummons it, right? Which is four. Uh, fuck off, dude. You know what? Whatever at this point. The AI is dumb. Use it. That's what I plan on doing there. Yeah, the AI does play stupid sometimes. Let's try it. Okay. Why did I just do two and not three? Uh, and it's the same thing that happened before. He had the game in the bag, but all he had to do was steal the other monster's attack, but it's comeback season. Indeed. Yes. Let's bring out the Speedroid dice again. I should have picked three cards, not two, but... That would bring me up to 26. What does this, okay. Right, that thing. Okay, so I gotta figure out what I wanna do. Cause he's at 25, I need a... Uh... I think I am. Oh, wait, I can't summon it this turn, can I? So he's gonna... Oh, uh, boy. He has no material, so the effect won't activate. Right. Whoops. Whoops. 
Ah, uh, I don't know what I should do. If I should attack him, though, or if I should save it and hope that he doesn't attack back. Because the smartest move would be to attack me next turn. I'm going to let it go. I'm going to see what happens. He pulled one stupid mistake. We'll see if he pulls another. Well... In my opinion, you have to attack. Read his card, second effect. He has those traps. Right. Uh. If you control a wind monster, you can special summon this card from your hand. And also cannot special summon uh, wind monsters. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... Special summon. Summon. The card I want to summon for that guy that 2600 is for. So, it should be fine the way it is. Okay. So ironically, this did work out for me. And unless that card is Yes. <sighs> is it just a one turn thing? Nope. The one trap that can stop you. Yep. <sighs> what the hell? Oh, right. Fun. Well, it's not going to do me any good, right? But... hate that deck. Alright. Well, if he draws a monster, it's over, but all right, he can't attack the first turn that he... <sighs> I kind of fucking hate both these decks. Yeah, his deck has a lot of synergy with cards that live in the grave. Way too many. I don't know what that card... <sighs> uh. 
I don't know. I'll wait to see what he does before I activate my death. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Why not? Yeah, his deck... Oh, yeah, yeah. Dude, this seems so fucking unfair. Seriously. Not only do I have to contend with him having a hand and a field, I have to contend with him having a graveyard. That's too much. I'm sorry. That's way too fucking much. It's like it, it's like that one duelist that Yuya fought at the beginning of the series said about it's unfair that you're the only one with summon monsters. It's a little bit too unfair that he's never without a hand. Wonderful. Sure, let's see how badly this starts. I think this is a bad hand. <sighs> Let me guess. He's going to destroy it again. Fuck off. He's going to bring out the two, and he's going to summon the dragon all over again. Yeah, though the main weakness of decks like this is you have to give up card advantages for the graveyard plays, but the rank three card is dumb powerful. It is. The major issue is, too, is that this story deck down here is not built like a real deck. It's built to do a gimmick. <sighs> but its effect is negated. Wonderful. I have one. That doesn't even work. Oh, up two. Uh, okay. Okay, so what does... <sighs> Alright, so here's what I'm going to try to do. Oh no, I can't even do that, can I? I was going to summon it, but it needs another monster to do its effect. <sighs> I don't have a choice. I mean, I do, but... I fucking hate this deck. Actually, I, I take that back. I hate both decks. The only difference is, is I hate that deck because it actually is built way too well. I hate this deck because it seems like it's built on a gimmick that isn't even working. You could go into the level 4 one, but he more than likely has the card to negate or power it up. Yeah. And that was the problem. I can't even summon the 4 yet without having something in the graveyard. But, yeah, he probably does because he powered this up and I, I was... So, basically, it's I'm surrendering.
I'm not even gonna try. Yeah! Nice tip! Except it failed three times! <sighs> okay! Because here's the thing. The great thing about playing a computer when it gets a bad hand is when it gets a bad hand, it's screwed. But because it has the great card, I don't get that effect. No matter what I summon, he seems to always summon something else. Wonderful. Budget. Let's try. Let's watch him screw me in one turn. Wonderful. Banish this card from your game. Well, this is not how I wanted to do it, but you know what? Wait, when this card is normal or special summoned? Except the red eyes. Okay, nope. I'm already surrendering. I, I fucked that up by not reading as per usual. He's got me so aggravated and flustered. So I have about 20 minutes to beat him. That's good information, at least for when you want to use that effect to get a tuner. Yeah. It is good information, don't get me wrong. What I learned is very helpful. All right, so we're actually going to play this correctly this time. Yes. Because I could be wrong, but I, I'm pretty sure it wants me to summon the 2500 the very first turn. The only thing I can hope for is that he gets such a bad hand that anything he tries with this is going to get screwed. Yeah, see, you are right about this, is that me losing is helping me get to know this deck. Then we will just leave it and see what happens. I was wanting to summon the 2200, so when he destroys it next turn, I can only imagine where this is going. I mean, even with a hand of all traps, he has trap monsters he can use the turn he sets them. Yep. <laughs> Really? <sighs> yes. <sighs> okay. Well, at least now I can do this. 
before I do. Okay. Let me think this through. When this car is normal, you can target one speedroid monster you control. Actually, no, this still works. I'm just going to have to play this. Oh, wait, I can't, can I? Oh, wait, no, I just... What? I thought it negated it. Okay, it did. But this still works. I wanted to summon the 2200, but you know what? Up to two. Oh, that's cool to know. I shouldn't do it, but I am so far in the lead. You can pop his face down. I can. But I think I'm more worried about his traps. How good are his traps while they're on the field? Ah. Now, let's get rid of these two. Uh, I'm thinking about trying to destroy his trap, but I don't know. I could do one and one. Can he? Okay, he can do it in general. So yeah, let's go ahead and pop that. <sighs> All right. We're going to use Joey's luck. Unless it stops in the middle of the two of them, wherever it's closer. So one... Two, three. Yeah, we'll see if that works. Let's see what other effects we have. Nah, we'll take a gamble. We'll put it in defense to be safe. I mean, no. It's got to be the other two, right? Yeah, it's got to be him going to a six. I want to see what he can do first. Oh, no. See what he can do. Uh, 
All right, wh what is he trying to do? You got this. I hope so. Oh, God. Let's see if this works. Uh, wait, that's... All right, we have it next. Does the sword do piercing? No, it doesn't. This is all... This is all dependent on what he draws. Okay, target one speed droid. Special summon it, but its effects are negated. Also, roll a six-sided die, and its level becomes the result until the end of the turn. You can banish this card from your grave after the effect resolves. I gotta take a chance. Okay, well, fuck you there. Oh, God. He is summoning it, isn't he? And I can't do anything. Fuck! This is pissing me off! You can target one of your banished speed roid cards. Add it to your hand. Wait, 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 wait. No, wait, wait, wait. If this card is sent to the graveyard, you can target one of your banner speed roid cards, add it to my hand. Once per turn. Okay, I have no idea what's going on, but. Let's. The AI confuses me so much. We'll use that. I don't know if there's a three in there or not. Uh, wonderful. How do I even do this? Ah, I can't do this. When this card is no more summoned, you can turn one of those people to my graveyard and special summon it. Oh, I wish it would have been this guy I could summon, because then I could switch him and level three or lower. So that leaves. <sighs> Normal summoned or special summoned. Okay. This brings me to 26, which I can't do. <sighs> Wait. Wait. If he can't beat me, I think I can do this. I think I have this. Okay. 
Three, one, six. I think I can do this. You can use this guy's level three guy, summon a tuner from the deck and secret or something, but I don't know where to go from there. I do. I do. <sighs> summon special summon. I know how to win this. Yes. Maybe I know how to win this. Depends on what that graveyard causes me. What effect? What effect? I don't want to say yes and then it screws me into it. If this card is sent to the graveyard, right, which we would already have done. You can banish this card from your graveyard. Oh, okay. No. Okay. What? Oh, okay, I did do it. If you click to activate, it won't pop it unless you choose to and can back out. I was going to say I've been iffy sometimes, but I got this. Unless he can stop me. This does have piercing, by the way. Now I let him kill it. And then I bring him back next turn and I do it again. The only thing that can stop me. What? I'm not even gonna ask. The only thing that can stop me is that stupid card. But why? Why what? Why didn't he attack me? Because his attack went back down to 2,000. Or do you... So what exactly confused you that time? Because remember, I'm not as good with the newer cards. No, please, stop. Clear wing. Spin storm. Sky strike. Uh, Yuto. Yuto, wake up. It's over. This is yours. Take it, Yuya. Always remember... Use your power to keep the world entertained and smiling. I will. For you. But instead of simply vanishing, Yuto's spirit joined with Yuya's. Back at Duel Academy in the fusion dimension. Oh, you're Leo Akaba. Here. After examining the memories of our young spy, Sora Purse, we discovered some very interesting information. Oh, his attack went back down. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, because I, I didn't know that his attack could go back up. So, actually, I could have won it multiple ways. Yeah, because I was like, why did he turn into defense mode? And then I looked up and his attack was back to 2,000. But it didn't matter because as long as he didn't activate that one card to stop my effect, I knew I could use that jet to remove a card and um take off another 500. But... The effect of that card that I had was that even if he did kill it, which I was actually planning on because I didn't know the monster was going to go down to 2,000, if there's no cards on my field whatsoever, I can special summon it from my graveyard. And I knew I'd special summon it, then use its effect, pray that he didn't negate it, and take off the last 500. 
yeah. But you are right, AI does confuse me sometimes. After examining the memories of our young spy, Sora... Oh, yeah. The fourth piece. Oh! Sora, you look... Kingdom Hearty-ish. I have been searching for her name is Zuzu Boyle. Find her and bring her here, y Yuri. Obelisk Assault. Oh, God, I can only imagine what this... A dark reflection. So I'm going to get wrecked next time. But I have a feeling I have a better chance of winning with him than I did him. Okay. Yuri, the character in the series with black Air Force energy. <laughs> All right. So that was pretty intense, that last match. I... Wasn't sure if I could beat that. But thankfully, it finally went my way. All right. So, we will leave it here for the day for Yu-Gi-Oh! I'm going to take a break, come back with one more stream for Divinity Original Sins. And then tomorrow, we should have three to four streams again. Starting with Yu-Gi-Oh! Moving on to one or two rounds of Divinity... And back to As Divine Hearts, which we've been away from for a few days. But until then, remember, you can catch all my live streams on my YouTube channel. It should be somewhere in the link around Twitch. It is also the home of 1,500 plus videos, including Rose Plays, highlights from the streams, the streams themselves, and other Rose Play shows. As always, I'd like to thank you, gamer, for not only showing up and entertaining me and keeping me from completely raging. But for kind of leading me through the ropes of some of the card effects. Since, as I've stated before, GX was about as high as I got. And I think I quit Yu-Gi-Oh! physically somewhere around mid-2000s. But, until then...